dreams, dreams, dreams are the gateway to the unseen <laughs> or the unheard of. Dreams make the impossible possible. Dreams are our friends or friend. <laughs> Until you're shaking your brother and your dad says, when is it my turn? <laughs> it's not a good dream. Let's get real. <laughs> what? You ever fucked your old man in a dream? Well, I have. <laughs> we laughed about it. It's, it's one of those things you bring up at a bonfire. <laughs> There's no bonfire. <laughs> you know, typically comedians don't heckle. <laughs> typically. <laughs> right. I mean, I like you. I, I but you so. are seemingly a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, right. for not knowing me, that's very accurate. Just good. Yeah, no, I don't, but like I said, I don't mind you. Uh, not too long ago, I was, uh, I was asleep next to my wife. And I was dreaming. And, uh, I dreamt, I, I had a dream about cold soup. Cold soup. So I woke up, referred to the dream dictionary. And uh, if you dream about cold soup, it means that you are not sexually satisfied by your partner. So I turned to my wife and said, honey, I think I'm having your dreams again. <laughs> 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 Boy, I was watching uh, the, the news the other day, and I came to the conclusion, you know, if you're going to title something news, perhaps it should be new. Now, don't get me wrong, I understand that these events are happening, and they, you know, I guess... I don't want to use the word new. It's not new. These are repeats. Oh, pillaging in Scarborough. Repeat. <laughs> weather. I mean, weather happens every day. Cold, rainy, sunny. Uh, whatever it is, it's happened before. <laughs> I, was, I had a dream where the news was actually new. Ladies and gentlemen, breaking news. Sidewalk gives birth. <laughs> Baby says first word through interpretive dance. <laughs> Thanks. <clears throat> you know, winter, winter. Some people call it winter. Winter's really got me down. I don't like the winter. I was walking up uh, the street to work the other day. I saw a bird. Now this is not one of those birds that hangs around in the winter. It was a bird that should be south, and I was thinking to myself, what are you doing here? Go, leave. And I started thinking, well, hold on, Brian. Maybe, maybe he has a good reason. Perhaps, perhaps he's waiting on his wife. Come on, honey, I hate the back of the V. Let's go. <laughs> there probably won't even be a V. It'll just be us, it's more of an equal sign. <laughs> and I'm not an expert on aerodynamics, it's just sort of instinct. But I think we should be at the back of a V. Our enemy. Like I said, I don't like the back of us. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I don't mean it. I've, I've said it three times already. I think you're a nice guy. You know you want me here, really. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. You guys forming any opinions right now? Yeah. He's a cunt. <laughs> hey. Yeah. He's a cunt? Guys can't be cunts. I'm not jam, really. No, guys can't be cunts. Well, hold, okay, you know what? I'm not going to write the essay tonight. However, <laughs> I think I'm pretty sure guys are dicks. Uh, so yeah, you're forming some opinions, right? You know, I get really, I get bogged down by opinions. Everyone's got an opinion. You know, all day long, they're coming at me. If opinions were baseballs, 
I would have welts all over my body. You know, people are whipping them, whipping them at me. Now, there are some opinions that aren't whipped at you. It's more of an underhand toss, you know. Oh, I've done a considerable amount of research, and I believe this is the movie that you and I should see. It has a, 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 an 82% on Rotten Tomatoes, and uh, based on the actors that are employed in this particular piece, I really, no, I think, yeah, I think this is a fine film for us to see. That's fine. I can catch those, right? If we're going with the baseball analogy, you know, that's an opinion I can catch. <laughs> However, there are opinions out there that are sort of a speed bump or a fast bump. You know, uh, oh, equal rights! <laughs> I can't catch those. Those are painful. <laughs> All right, dreams. Not too long ago, I had a dream. I was at a grocery store. I was in the salad dressing aisle, and I got a good glance of all the salad dressing bottles. And it occurred to me in the dream, all of these bottles are shaped the same. Forget brand, all the brands, everyone is taking on the same shape. So in real life, I decided, well I didn't decide, I, out of necessity I went to the grocery store and I looked at the salad dressing aisle. And um, it's true, they're all shaped the same. And it got me thinking, why are salad dressing bottles all shaped the same? Do the manufacturers think that salad dressing requires specific dimensions for optimum taste? Or do, what? What the fuck do you want, man? <laughs> I don't want to interrupt. You're going to tell me that not all salad dressing know, bottles are shaped? No, I was going to say, the reason it is, is because salad dressing bottles, when I'm looking for You're dressing... You're such a prick! When I'm looking, <laughs> when I'm looking for, for dressing... Sarah, I'm shut up! up. You Let me finish! No! No! no. I, if you understand what a comedic bit is, it's, it's the allowance of someone finishing their thought. That's really what it is. No, that's what it is. The, the reason is, I'm dumb. Eric, Eric, nobody talk to okay, you. Okay, Enjoy the show. I mean, like I said, this is the fourth time. It's not going to ruin the joke, really. Well, actually, it already has. It's not going to add right either. Let him tell the joke. Well, this is not charity, Dan. You know. Well, how did I help you? I am a Vulcan. I'm from the planet Vulcan. I'm sorry. Is that right? Well, logic would suggest that you wouldn't talk during someone's stand-up set. Am I wrong? No. Woo! That was an amazing. I'm sorry. Amazing. All right. That's all right. What's your name? You don't even know. It's Is Spock. it Andrew? It's Eric. Spock for now. Aaron? Eric. Oh, uh, Eric. Don't tell me. Is that with a, an E? I'm sorry, I dropped you out. It's with an E and a C. I'm sorry. Go ahead. It's fine. I don't know. I'm just getting so excited. That's all. Your joke was so funny. Your, it was your excitement. Okay. All right. Last thing. Just one. Zip. Right. Eric, no more. Please. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm not proud of this dream. Okay? This is a dream I'm not proud of. However, it occurred. And I'm going to talk to you people about it. I... Oh, it pains me to say. Because this is not me. This is not who I am. I, in a dream, I, I forcibly made a woman have sexual intercourse with me. Now, as you people might know it, and it's been said before tonight, but I don't want to, I just, oh, it's just such a horrible word. Oh, I raped a girl in a dream. No, I'm sorry, it was a dream. But it got me thinking, just like the whole salad dressing thing that Eric fucked up. <laughs> what, how, how are these guys getting boners when they're going into rape girls? I mean, you know, it's probably, it's a few steps before you go in. You know, arms flailing, people screaming, not to mention the girl. <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> you know, I know this Jewish guy, he's 52 years old. Right now he would say, fuck you, that's funny. But I'm not gonna say that. I just think that if perhaps, maybe, hmm, I shouldn't have said the word rape. Do you guys know what makes, do you guys know? Oh boy. <laughs> okay, so this is my comedy voice. This is, uh, hey, I'm Brian, this is my real voice. Sorry about that, guys. I'm really sorry. <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, people are supposed to, you're supposed to, <laughs> it's supposed to be in a, a place where you can say what you want to say. I didn't mean, I honestly didn't mean, I didn't mean anything. <laughs> I was just, I was just trying to tell a joke. I just thought it was funny, like, I didn't, I did I would never ever do that to a girl, I'm so sorry. Please don't hate me, like, don't think of me as that kind of person, because I'm not, I'm not that kind of person. I'm, I mean, my first girlfriend, I said, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> I swear I'm not the... <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks. Brian Mark. <laughs> Thank you.